<laughs> Alright guys, as we said earlier, time now is 4, 440. Uh, we got direct orders from the city manager, approved by the mayor. What we're going to do this evening is we're going to start off by giving PAs on the north side, here in the middle at the northeast, on the south. This building is condemned as of this morning. There should be nobody in there. They're having issues with people breaking in and stealing the property of people that do live here that have left the property. So what we're going to do is we are, after the PAs, we're going to walk in through this north door. We're going to go through each individual apartment, knock on the door, identify ourselves, tell them that they are to leave immediately. <laughs> Reason being is we are going to secure every door and there will be no way to get in. So ensure we identify ourselves at each door. We go in. Um, let's start off by giving PA. So who's well, while you guys do that, Chief, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go talk to some homeless people, go talk people to there. People over here. I'm going to tell them to walk through before we walk through. Warn everybody while you guys are doing the PAs. So let's start PAs on this side. It's the nearest car. <coughs> Just tell them this is the Espino Police Department. This is the condemned building. Is the hassle on the door right away? Hold on. Give us a, give us a couple minutes. I'm going to talk to these guys here. Okay. And have them kind of do a walkthrough before we do. Okay. How's it going? How's it going? Are you the only one here? Oh uh, no, my wife's in there somewhere. I was gonna ask you if you could do me a favor. Yeah, what's up? So we're gonna go through now, and we're securing the building, and we're condemning it. Right. Everyone's supposed to be out right now. Right. If you can get some of your friends, I don't. I'm mean, obviously they saw us, so they bounced. Yeah, right. Now it's kind of like a grace period, bro. Yeah. We're not gonna run anybody for fucking warrants. We're searching anybody for fentanyl. If you wanna walk through and tell them, hey, the police are here. They're coming to kick everybody out. If you're caught in here after hours, you're going to jail. Okay. If, you want, if you can do that for me, bro, yeah. Yeah. save no us a headache and get everyone out of here ASAP. No problem, I can do that. You're going to go in there and help him with that? This Perfect. is the Espinal Police Department. This building has been condemned. You have five minutes to exit the residence. Do you try hitting you with your purse? Yeah, I should. Good. You know you got. Uh, it's about six. Whoa. Are they gonna open it tomorrow to get the rest of the stuff? From my understanding, no, bro. So you guys get all your shit out now as much as you can. You guys got five minutes. And then we're going to have to start running people and searching people. See? Isn't this a much more effective way? This is the SPL Police Department. This building is being condemned. Hey, so real quick. Five minutes to exit the What's that? They're not ready. They said they're going to get like tomorrow. The no, the, today was the last day. So I told the guys in there, what we're going to do is we're going to give you guys a heads up. We're giving you guys five minutes to go in there, get all your shit, and get it, warn all your friends. And leave. We're not running anybody right now. We're not searching anybody. We're not taking anyone to fucking jail. Okay? Go and tell all your friends and family, whoever else is in there, to Wait, get their shit and get out. So you can't get the rest of their stuff tomorrow, like they said. Let's let's focus on getting everyone out of there now and condemning it, because anyone caught after tonight is going to go to jail. <clears throat> tell everybody you know, because like I said, if they're caught in here after we lock it, they're going to jail. You guys can leave all your stuff out here. You guys are going to board up windows and shit like that? No, we're nice. just doing all exterior doors. Just nice, just the doors. Okay. Yeah. You got to get a flat tire. <laughs> our, uh, our tires are needle-proof. <laughs> Um, right now, we're trying to get as much stuff as you can right now. Okay. Okay. I know it's kind of, you guys have had a couple weeks to, to kind of prepare for this, so that's why we're here taking this drastic measure. We would have been here sooner, but some stuff came up, so.
How does it feel to be out of the academy? Live a normal life in. <laughs> this will become a form of so only way normalcy for you. You know why I miss the academy? Because I get to sleep. That's the one thing to do. You get to sleep. Go to bed, get out of class at 5, go back to dorm, go to bed at 6, wake up at 4. Why aren't you sleeping now? You don't have kids. Me, I just freaking, I gotta work graveyard now. I can't sleep. I'm not oh. used to this. I took care of it as best I could. Nope, you, know? I, you did your best, man. That's all I ask. Like I said, anybody caught in here will be going to jail tonight, so. A ladder? From my understanding, ma'am, what I was told is everyone has to vacate today. They're locking the. Why didn't they tell us this when they were here today? They told us we have more time, but. Yes, Lou Baker's the one that told me. Lou Baker's the owner of the apartments, correct? Is that who the owner is? No, Lou Baker's the one with us that works for the city hall. Because I have the guys from the city hall here, and none of that was mentioned. That's why we're here. I was here today when they were all here. And she told me, I'll bring you a letter. I think, like I said, man, the reason why we're telling everyone to leave now is because we're locking the building. So, yeah, that's why she said they were going to bring up the letter, that way stating who we are. And we could, so we could walk out with that letter that who we are. No one's going to be here, ma'am. It's going to be locked. So how am I going to get out of here? I don't have a car. I'm sorry, ma'am. I know they posted this <laughs> weeks back. No, they didn't. They posted it this last week. This has been in the talks for, for a while. Yeah, I know it's been in the talks. I went to the meetings. I, I, we had a meeting. And unfortunately, it's it's people like you that have to suffer for other people's pendejadas. Yeah, so now I'm going to stay in the street. I know that they were. I'm having to my son's on a wheelchair. I I understand that, ma'am, but I know that they gave out vouchers for you guys to stay at the. Uh, yeah, we haven't gotten ours yet till tomorrow. Have, okay. My son doesn't have no feet. He's on a wheelchair. Where am I gonna go? Like I said, ma'am, this this came from above me. I'm I'm just I'm just a lieutenant. You see the city? They're liars. I'm just I a lieutenant. Said, I'm, I mean, you know, this frustrating. Why didn't they tell me this today? Lou Baker's the one that told me. I promise you. You will not have to leave. Like I said, Mom, I was told by the mayor and the city manager to come out here. Oh, uh, John's another one that told me, too. I mean, I can talk to, I don't know where Jeff Sargent's at. Do you guys know where Jeff Sargent? Find Jeff Sargent for me real quick. Yeah, Jeff Sargent? John was here. I'm not John was here. But we were at the meeting. But the, the thing it is, Mom, is we're, we're locking the doors. The chief police. The chief's here today, too. So then why didn't you tell me? I know we're locking the doors, ma'am, and... What doors? All of them. All these here? All the exterior doors to this building. Uh, oh, it's busy. My son's, like I say, his, he doesn't have no feet. He just got out of the hospital. Who's your son? Johnny Cardunia. He used to be a bad person way back in the day. He lost his feet? Yeah. He's diabetic and they amputated half his feet. Oh, shoot, sides. okay. He doesn't have uh, toes. See, they didn't give us any of this warning today. She told me. You know, she should have told us. I talked yeah. to Lou Baker and, uh, what's that tall Weddell's name? They were all at the meeting Tuesday. Jordan? I don't know, he's a... The city manager? Yes. And, uh, John wasn't here. Maybe he was, he was somewhere else. And the chief of police. Yes, sir. So she's claiming that, uh, there was going to be letters... Yeah, they can go pick up letters from City Hall that will be issued to them from Blue Baker, the city manager, authorizing them to come back, but not now. It'll have to be after. Oh, okay. And it'll be dated for when Yeah, but can I stay here tonight? No. So why, am I, why didn't she tell us this today? Uh, we not, had told... Uh, I don't know. 
Yeah. Now we're all. Were there when I was talking to her. We're all doing what we're told. Of. We, this, 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 we're not coming over here on our own. We were told no, to come I know. here. But the stuff's not to leave the homeless with all my stuff. Well, that's the thing is, we're gonna go through and make sure no one's in here, to to make sure that no one is going to be stealing anything. Yeah, and what's gonna happen with my son? He's disabled. No feet. Oh Okay. You can get my truck if you want it. Oh, you give me truck? Yeah, I get a normal oh, ring, go bro. You want the truck? You can have my truck. Write that down. Okay. okay. Remind me. Remind me. <coughs> okay. So I think this goes without saying. Heavy, heavy CR tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Heavy CR tonight because I thought. I was under the impression that they're going to board the windows, but no, they're just locking the doors, so. Alright. Well, it's just Paige told us and I tonight, so we'll do what we can. Yeah, just like I said, I know, I know you guys are spread thin, but do what you guys can and CRs and stuff like that over here, so. Yes, sir. Can you give me, do you have access to kick, time kickback? I need my kickback. <laughs> if, Richard's are, if Richard's already approved them, no. Because if I'm already approved, it, like, if I've already approved them, I can't. They're out of my hands. Yeah, timesheets are due until tomorrow. And he's got to adjust his... Because I came in early. Email, uh... Email Sandra. Alright. Email Sandra and... You tell her to kick it back. You have to the first thing tomorrow morning at like 8 or 8.30. Okay. But I'll send her an email tonight. I'm going to do one more call out and then... Hmm? Start walking or... Oh! oh. Hey, huh? you. I'm gonna go do. I'm gonna do one more call out and then start walking. Or yeah, we'll go. Walk. Yeah, one more call out and we'll give it a little bit of time. This is the SEO Police Department. Facility Division Dan. You have five minutes to get to the residence. Facility Division Dan. Nope. So they're gonna leave it open until tomorrow at 10. So we're not locking it. Well, they're gonna lock this side and the other side, but they're gonna leave the center open. But he'll come and talk to you now. Why are we even here? <laughs> I have people coming tomorrow to help me. Yeah, so. Who called me? Who? Or. Hey, they still want Zara to follow? What is he? Does anyone want Zara to follow? Can I? Who, me? I don't. Didn't they want her? They started to email, didn't they? And I just got. They're that I just got a face. Okay. Give one of the ID units a public service bro, I don't know. I'm not aware of anything. So the combo that for the locks that we're putting over there is four zero five zero. Yeah, so it's so like just text it to me. Yeah. And, it, it and it's just all it is is four oh five North Passeo, but we have a zero. Okay. Where's the chief at? You guys hang out on this side. <laughs> Uh, which lady? Come in in the morning, cause I gotta go work and I'll be back at midnight. Uh, there's no ladies here that are. No, he told me to get a some kind of. Uh, at city hall tomorrow. Oh, uh, I gotta go. At city hall tomorrow. Will yes. I be able to come back at midnight back in here? I'm only working like maybe five hours tonight. So my understanding, bro, is we're we're completely selling it because the homeless people have been stealing. Yeah, I know. They 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 came in. Uh, Tuesday night, they try to break into my house. So I think that's why they're locking it and not letting anybody inside. So if I leave, I can't come back in. Correct. So, so that's my understanding now, yes. 
And then they gotta go to City Hall to get a paper at the City Hall. Get that letter at City Hall. That gives <clears throat> that gives you permission to come back and uh, at a certain date and time to remove this, your stuff from the Because I just got informed that I just got a place today, and I got people coming in in the morning to help me because everybody's working right now. All my family members. So like I told you, go to City Hall in the morning. Get that paper. It's, it'll be signed by the city manager. Allowing you to come out. One of the units 87 to the north end of the building. Out here with you. When your team is here to move your stuff out. We'll open hey, the door. We're at the north side of the building, Kino. Hey, units are on the north side where you at. Is that a real gun? No, I Looks like you're doing it. She got it babe, right in her front. Well, because my babe didn't want her son to see it. I had just came and they said he needed help. So I was back and forth. I'm helping my babe. You guys are holding one of the ID units? Yeah, Byron said. Okay. I saw the Polish yeah, nationwide and the nationwide, no bots. I was here to comply with your peer permission. You guys go let all your people know that we're not going to check people for warrants. If we walk through, people we need contact with are going to get ran. So, but, are they able to stay here or no? no. Everyone has to leave. Even the ones that live here? Everyone has to leave. Everyone. What everyone, if everyone. they had to 10? I thought they just said 10 in the morning now. Okay. I don't get it. Hold on. They're saying till 10 in the morning and then they're saying no. Lotus, we got him. Um, Qualified, and he has a room at Motel so, 6. Okay, so it looks like we got rooms for everybody. So no, what, I, what I was going to let them do is the people didn't have rooms to stay here. And I was going to just lock so this door and the far door and leave the middle door open for the night. But it looks like everybody has got rooms. Because I'm afraid of locking anyone in. And, yeah. Well, the thing is, is, if we just lock, if we leave that front door open, then it's going to be a free-for-all here. And we don't want them to take. So do you guys think if, if you all have a place to live, we're gonna lock it all up because we want to protect whatever property you all have. We're not gonna allow anybody in here. We're, we're not gonna allow anybody in here. We will have a letter to be able to come in and get yeah. us. Yeah. So go to so to clarify on that, you guys go to city hall tomorrow. She's gonna get us right there. I'm gonna there. get the letter. Everybody's okay. gonna get a letter. Do we okay. think you are the only ones that are still here? Yeah. Nobody else. Can you guys do me a favor, yeah. real quick? I know, no, real quick. If you guys can do a quick walkthrough. Right now, we're not running anybody, we're not checking anybody for warrants, none of that yeah, shit. If you guys can walk through and tell people that to leave, because if we walk through and we find people, we're running people, we're taking them to jail. So if you guys want to run, walk through, tell everyone to leave. I'm hurting, brother. I'm getting out of Espanol. No, I've been out of Espanol. I'm good. I'm getting hurt out of Cool. So let's get everybody, let's get everybody So if you guys want, because you guys all have a Go warn people. Thank you. We're gonna we're gonna go inside apartments. We're gonna go inside, and if people are caught inside, we're running people and taking them to jail. This is the last little. We're gonna have. This is it. You guys go through. Tell everyone to get the fuck out. So, sir, we think everybody's out of the building. Yeah, mostly. You all, uh, mostly or pretty much. Uh, Warn them, hey, April. If they're in here when we go in there, they're going to jail. We're going to go walk through and make sure. You tell them, like I said, tell them now is amnesty period. They leave, we don't care if they have warrants or anything like that. Tell them real quick, just tell them we're going to lock in. If we go inside, they're going to jail. They'll be locked in, and if we go in, they're going to go to jail. This is a condemned building. Now's the time to get out. Yeah. So let's at least start with that fact. Okay. Well, no, you know what? I know we're gonna start on that side. Once we walk through, they can do it. So you know what? Things are changing. We'll tell the city manager. We're just. I mean. Because I was afraid the thing somebody is, is was gonna get burnt in there, but if no, now if we're making the best effort to get rid of everybody, we're gonna do it. There's a lady here claiming that she's handicapped. 
But that her son is handicapped. No, she's gone. No, she's that, still here. She was just here. Well, she just told me he's gone. Oh, he's gone. Oh, okay. He's well, I'm telling you, sir. Um, okay, uh, Lou, Lou showed up. He's getting back to the Um, I'm getting told that they don't think anybody else is going to go to work in the last few years. Everything. I feel comfortable. I feel comfortable. So I told them, you guys go through and <coughs> tell your friends and your friends' friends and your homies and everybody that, uh, if, yeah, I'm still, I'm going to say like that. If anybody's caught in there and we go in there, they're going to jail. Now they're going to go in there and warn everybody, get your shit and get out. We're not running anybody right now or searching anybody, but if we go through and we're inside, we catch them inside the building, then we're going to. That's why I'm saying just have them hold them or hold her in detention. Okay, so I feel, I feel comfortable. Okay, all right. Let them know that they're not Huh? Uh, no, no, I searched I'm her still live, Chief. Martin did a secondary search and he should have Okay, I feel better. I'm still, I'm still live, Chief. We're still yeah, we're still. Hold on. Okay, I'll, I'll transfer to now. Daisy, one up and you Yeah, yeah, I take her up there to the... What, you have her? Huh? You have her? Go ahead. Huh? You have her? Yeah, she's in my back. The FBI's on, on their way to interview. Oh, shit. Right away. Hey, Martin. Martin. Martin, Martin, watch out. Watch out, Martin. Yeah. I have to go. Has anybody walked out or? Okay. Some lady from the River County Health. Is she the one that's wearing the vest? No. Okay. So I told him you guys walk through and tell him if we catch him inside, we're gonna take him to jail. Hey, are you an idea with Qualls? Says who? Well, All right, guys, the the twenty five the twenty five round course was approved by the academy, bro. You guys, he's gonna do the fifty for you. Yeah, our calls we have to do that, but over there with the game, you guys have to do the GPS call. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. We'll deal with that tomorrow, bro. We'll deal with that tomorrow. All right. Hey. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Oh shit. Okay. All right. Um, are you gonna be av are you gonna be uh, available tomorrow? We're here at Santa Clara Apartments. We're kind of ten six right now, but hi. I'll cool. I'll cruise. I'll cruise up there tomorrow. All right. Bye. You guys warn everybody. Yes. I went I upstairs. I couldn't find anybody. He's autistic and and Was it the police officer that pulled the plywood off the house upstairs? Me? Was it any police officer? 
Just pulled the fire out. Somebody was been pulling us this morning. They fucking moved around in there again. Who cares? It's all trash. Because I'm gonna sponsor for all the fucking mom to get everything. His mom just left. His mom just dropped the top. I know we're with him. They're trying, and there's one going around. Okay. Thank you guys. Okay, so you're telling me that there's somebody at 220? I believe so. I think he's still in there. He's that taller white 220, gentleman. 220, Matthew is not on premises. He oh. has checked into the motel. Okay, but well, it sounds like somebody's in his apartment. They're going to do their job and they're going to go from okay. room to room. 220? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Okay. You're gonna go with your dad? Yeah. Run with I was looking for your apartment. It's empty? No, no. Okay. I got, uh... I meant, I meant people-wise. People -wise. Me, my girl, and a couple friends of ours. Okay, you guys are leaving though, right? Yeah. We're okay. gonna have to. She's uh, trying to check on me some housing now, so... Because I got nowhere to go. Okay. So. They said we could stay tonight, huh? No. No, everyone has to leave because the thing is, is we've been getting a lot of complaints that the... The people who live here haven't been breaking the rules in regards to stealing shit. It's the, the people who are unauthorized to live here who are breaking into the apartment. Yeah, I thought that man told us we could mm -hmm. stay just for tonight and be out by tomorrow. Yeah. No, you guys got to get with her because she's, she's working on getting you guys a hotel. Yeah, we already have one. Okay. Yeah, we're just getting our stuff and putting the trailer. The thing you guys don't need to get everything out of here now. That's why we're making sure it's empty. Okay. I'm just trying to get my granddaughter. So hold on. We're making sure that everything, that we're making sure no one's in here. Yes. So that way you guys don't have to worry about your shit getting stolen. Oh, yes. Thank you. Yes, that. Yeah. Thank you, Jeff. My mom's truck, bro. They... Jack my battery, they took the we're, we're not even worried about that, but we're just making sure no one's inside here. Okay. But I don't want it to. I don't want to. Yeah, because they're going to get I told my officers to uh, to do patrols throughout the night, so my officers will be in and around. Really be pissed with me. No, I feel you right with you. You already pissed because they took her battery and pulled her speakers and stupid Miss. So you can have all day tomorrow. Okay. 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 I'll make sure all you gotta do. All day tomorrow. Okay. okay. Thank you. Just go to City Hall and get that letter, okay? Uh, I wanna, she's gonna pass that out. Oh, you're gonna. Oh, you're gonna. gonna, gonna go to the motel oh. I wanna deliver yeah. it to the Oh, perfect. Yeah. yeah. That way they can come in tomorrow, okay? Okay. okay. So then I haven't come talk to you then. Yes. Okay. Okay. So who did you call? Two five zero Maria. Anna Maria. Uh, Alvin's working on getting everyone out of there. On this one? Yeah. They're still in there? There's, I think. I just came my real quick. Hey, Alvin. Yeah. Who else is still in your apartment? Is there anyone else in your apartment? Yeah, my baby and a couple friends of mine. Okay. You gonna get everyone out? You gonna, uh, hey, Alvin, we're gonna start getting everyone out, so that way we can start locking it, locking it up. So. Okay, okay. All right. Me and my They already knocked on this door? Yeah, that's right. That's fine. That's what they broke into. They broke into our house. Yeah, sure. Yeah. 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 So like I, like I said, you guys just lock up your apartment. We're gonna, we're going through and making sure everything's out. That lady in the green is giving you guys the permission to come back and get all your stuff out tomorrow. She's gonna so. take a letter, I guess. To yeah, room. she's gonna go take a letter to the hotel. So. The police department. That one's empty. They came already. Okay. What about this yeah. Who's this? Who is in here? Watch. Watch out. Oh, okay. Yeah. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone. Okay, perfect. So downstairs, that was all. So we can only confirm downstairs. We're gonna walk out too. Uh, yeah, make sure you lock it up, guys. Yeah, I'm putting cords on the windows. Okay, thank you. And what about this one here?
Um, I don't know about her. I haven't seen her all day. She, she, she's, she's almost out completely. Uh, uh, she's almost out completely. She's been, so I don't think she's here. Okay. She's, she's almost out completely. Alright, we just want to make sure nobody's, okay, sounds good. So the bottom seat is completely empty. Okay. Everything, everything is done. Okay. All these are completely locked up. Hotels. That she's gonna give you guys. Hold on, hold on. Hey, ma'am, ma'am, listen, listen, listen. Okay. The lady downstairs wearing a vest. She's organizing to put people in a hotel for tonight. Okay. Which At that, she's gonna give you guys a letter so you guys can come back tomorrow and collect all your stuff okay. and get everything out. But you guys need to leave tonight. Okay. So then I gotta get my everything. You, just a couple things. That's it. You don't need to clean out your apartment tonight. Okay. It's just to get everyone out because all, all these apartments have been getting broken into. So, like, collect just we an overnight bag and then come tomorrow. Yes, ma'am. Talk to her then. Maggie, come on. We gotta get your shoes and your clothes. Come on. Make sure you get a warm jacket, brother, okay? Yeah, we have bigger jackets. Okay, put your shoes in a jacket. Like I said, you guys can. You guys. Yeah, let's just go, guys. Let's get our stuff. Just make sure you lock the door. Espanola PD. Let's get our stuff. Please, Marvin. What heard movement? Did you? Hey, come to the door. Please, Marvin. Occupants of 204, come to the hotel. I thought I heard someone in there though. No, that's Johnny and Michelle. They just left a while ago. They're already at the Motel 6. Are you on your way to Motel 6? Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm getting ready to go now. I don't know what we're going to do. So. Yeah, I know. It's kind of a last... break the doors down so we can come and get our stuff because we rented you houses. That's, so why we're, that's why we're making sure everyone's empty so that yeah. way no one breaks in. Yeah, so. it's just me. Okay. Uh, we're going to wait on these two, remember. Hey, Matt, go here. Wait with the chief over there, please. These two have to leave. Whose apartment is this? No Esmeral Police Department! Fuck the pigs! Nah! The West Side! Esmeral Police Department! Come out! Gotta go! Hey, brother. <coughs> yeah, you know, we're experiencing a lot going back and forth. Yeah, you can come in. We're almost, we're almost done, but uh, you can come up. Hit the second floor if you want. Who's that? I think you can get that door open. Huh? 
That door looks like it has COVID. Which one? Oh, I kicked the door and moved the door with the couch behind it. Yeah. <clears throat> Thank you, Mayors. By leading, by leading by example. You're ten eight tonight? Mayors <coughs> I have the I have the code to the door. That's the code for the combination at the front. Send it to me please. <coughs> this is the uh, this is the apartment they hit for with the feds. Mm. You guys aren't in trouble, it's just gotta leave. If you're caught here in the morning, you're going to jail. If you leave now, you're good. We're not checking names or anything like that. You just gotta eat your stuff and go. Speak now or forever hold your peace. Police Department! What are you guys doing? Uh, Alvin, you're supposed to leave the gap. I'm very comfortable. Go ahead. Ryan? Now you're doing police. Bro! What are you coming up to, man? Are we going to help the department? Staying out of trouble? Try. Try. Hey, do you guys know anybody else in here? Uh, we just we came from Alvin, so we I really don't know if anyone okay. was up here or who's not. Espanola PD, if you're in here, make yourself known. Hurry up. 
Are you guys authorized to live here? No, yeah. we do. Oh, yeah. Okay, so there's a lady downstairs that has a vest. Go talk to her. She's getting you guys hotels for the night, okay? Well, we already did all that. Okay, so you guys still have to leave. So you go yeah, talk yeah. to her, and she's going to take you guys okay. a letter okay. to allow you guys access in the morning to come and get all your shit out of okay, here. Okay, cool, cool. Nice. Hold on, quick Thank question. You. Thank you. Is there going to be somebody here, like, guarding the place? Cause We're going to have the, my... The guy said that he was going to lock all three doors. We're locking every person, single door. One person in the front watching the stuff. Because they're going to come around and check this shit. They put ladders and break through the windows and shit like that. Just make sure your windows are secured. I call my guys to come over here and do patrol stuff. I'm the patrol sergeant for tonight, okay? Okay. We're going to have guys that are patrolling this area right here. Because I have this radio. I get it. I get it. I get it, dude. I know this sucks. But this is not a safe place to live anymore. Oh. Captain. I hate this place. So, I'm going to have to get a shirt, get some stuff that you need to leave right now. An overnight bag. You guys should go to a hotel. Get that letter and come back tomorrow. We gotta make it too roll. We said to make it too roll. You just need an overnight bag where you can come here in the morning. Yeah, yeah, no, but um, let me tell you what happened today. My mom got sick, so and then she had a dental surgery today. I just got back though, so. He said that once we go down to the bottom, yeah, they're yeah, locking yeah, it up. No, I'll get, I'll get what I need for the overnight, whatever, because we already set up the the, the motel room. But I need to get my cat, my dog, because we already authorized them because they're service animals. Be saying there, bro. I can't. It, this I'm is not gonna go over the time. Just no, I need like five. You got like five minutes, bro. Five, five minutes, bro. I you just need clothes, your dog, some stuff for I them the night. Bro, that won't take you five minutes, bro. Cause it's about my head. They're locking everybody okay, in here in a little bit. Okay, I, I cleared that one. I cleared that one. Page. Oh, this one I got already. Yeah, I already got that one. Oh, they need my example, huh? I have to. <laughs> Lock from the inside. Yeah. Hello. Please watch. Espanol PD. I can hear the TV on in there. You come out and talk to me. I know that she took it. She's not just taking it. Please Police department. I can hear the TV on in there. You need to vacate the building, it's been condemned. Do they give you guys a hotel? Uh, they, mm -hmm. I don't know, they should talk, but I'm not sure I've been sick the past three or four weeks, though. There's a lady downstairs wearing a green vest, reflective vest. Okay. We'll talk to her, she's issuing out those uh, oh, letters. I don't know her name. Okay. She's issuing out the letters. Is there going to be a security uh, around the scene? This is where the folks are breaking in and taking There's somebody in here. I just the TV on. They're going to be locked in. Okay, well, I'll be down there. Please, <laughs> Portman. <laughs> Did it have a shot too? Oh, go check it out. Huh? Yeah. Who is it? Ew. I don't know what it's not. Please, Marvin! Come out! Gotta go! Ah. Good, to you, good to see you, bro. Stay out of trouble. Uh, sure. Hey. Police department. Come on, make yourself known. Check, you can check behind the couch. Yep. Espanola PD, make yourself known. Come out.
pretty innovative how they uh, put the couch up against the door. Did you check the fridge? I'm not even looking there. Get out of here. Oh, fuck. Go tell Vicente in the top corner. He has to get his shit and get the fuck out. We have one person that's coming down now, so. Flowers is going to be a little bit of a pain in the ass. He's not moving his ass. He stays locked in then. Huh? He stays locked in. So you can do that one already then? Uh, we have one up top that's leaving. So they they're they're on their way. Yeah, so they can come up to here. Now this side is already up? Uh, yes, everyone's out. Okay, so we can shut this side down. Yeah. Is this guy here or no? Yeah. Oh, he's still in there. Yeah. Yes, yes, I'll do it. You guys have to leave yes. right now. Yeah, we're grabbing the few shit right now. Okay. Michaela, if Matthew's there, I don't give a shit if Matthew's with you. Just get out. Michaela. Vicente? No, uh, Regina. Oh, okay. What did we saw?
That's it. No one else in there? Nope. Cool. Close it up. Last one. Just throw it in a moment. You guys gotta go for the main shit. He's taking this bag. That's not right. No, it's not. Okay. Well, let's do Hey, Jess, what's up? Oh. Hey, what's up? Um, I can ask them. Is that your? Is there a guy in the face? Okay. Let me make a phone call. I'll call you back. Uh, All right. Did we send it? Come out. Okay. You know what? This is very much of those.